So you might be in a situation where for some reason Android Auto is not working when you're plugging in your phone to your specific device. Now, the reason why this may be happening, there's an unlimited amount of reasons this could be happening, but the quickest way to troubleshoot this is by making sure that your phone even supports Android Auto. So what you can do is you can make way over to your settings application of your Android phone. You now go and click on search and you can just search up Auto and most of the time you should be able to see some sort of Android Auto thing. If Auto doesn't come up, you can just search up Android Auto. And usually there should be something that comes up with Android Auto. So you can see I do have a setting here for Android Auto. And that is very important. If you do not see any settings for Android Auto, that means your phone probably does not support Android Auto and you should probably update your phone because there's a problem there or maybe your phone just doesn't support it. Now if you click on Android Auto, you should be able to see this little panel comes up. If you see this panel come up, you should be able to go ahead and probably configure out this device with your you know, car or whatever you have. So that is a very important thing to keep in mind there because if you don't have this, like if you don't have this Android Auto panel that comes up, well, that's going to be the issue. Now, the next thing I, want to, I would probably recommend you to kind of look at is with your USB cord that you're using. If you're plugging in now, if it's a wireless connection, never mind this, but if you actually do have a wired connection connected from your Google or from your Android phone, not your Google from your Android phone, and if it's a faulty cable, if the cable is not working or if it's not a good quality cable, lots and lots of issues can happen just by having a bad cable. So just make sure that's not the issue either, because if it is, well, there's not really not that much you can do about it. But if you do have a good proper cable here that's connected, well then go ahead and just make sure that you're using the proper cable, make sure the cable's not messed up, make sure the USB port here is cleaned out, and that could be another thing you can try, you know, kind of looking into as well. If your phone does support, you know, wireless Android Auto and your car supports it as well, you might as well do it that way because that's probably going to be a better way to do it. Now, if that's still not working, the other thing you can try doing is restarting your phone. You can also try seeing if there's an update available for your phone. So go inside of your settings application here. You want to go and click on system or wherever your system update panel is. And you want to go and see if there's an update available. If there is, just go and update your phone. And that's another thing you can try doing as well. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.